How do you do? Storyteller here, back with the Amazon Trail, and we are right back into it. We've just finished talking to these people, and we're about to leave, and hopefully, yep, we got our achievement. The Ancient Ones are pleased with what you have done. To mark your success, I will put this badge on my shield. And we got a new badge on the shield. Yay, that's our second one. As I said before, we're going to try to get all of them. Okay, and I do not remember where that woman told me to go. So I'm guessing we're gonna head southwards because that's, that sounds familiar. So I'm gonna follow the south bank. Well, before I do, we can do a little fishing. Gotta stay stocked up on supplies. Ooh, release it. I remember from the last one, it told us not to keep sharks. I don't know, I would think sharks would be a good source of food out here. Whatever. No, nope, that's a shark again. I know a shark when I see one. Here, yeah, fish, fish, fish. Fish, fish, fish. Oh, whatever. And there's no food in this level, I remember that. Alright, so that was a waste of time. We got two fish, though. So it can't be all that bad. Check the map. We need to start going west now. There we go. And fish, fish, fish. See, there's more fish over here now. We're getting better at this. Keep. And keep. Keep. Yay! And... Row, row, row your boat. Let's check with the guy. How are we doing? We have been traveling for 20 days. We are going at a steady pace. Our meals are normal, and we have 100 pounds, sorry, 145 pounds of fish and 106 pounds of fruit. Your health is good. Good to know. There are people screaming outside. Psycho neighbors. I've said this before in other videos where psycho neighbors have been screaming. Our neighbors are completely psychotic. So let's try to ignore them. Let's go back. <sighs> and let's double check the map. Making good time here. Let's check the rainforest again. Well, we can try to identify some creatures. No? There we go. We identified that one. And that's an anteater. I knew that. I know an anteater. Is it a skimmer? No. No, it's not black. Stupid. Spoon boom. Shut up! Oh my gosh. Motorcycles and screaming neighbors. And... Ay, 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 ay. Cool, so we've identified some animals. It is a madhouse here. Let's check on the fish. And another fish. Good, good. Many fish. And come on. Come on. Oh well. And row, row, row your boat. 
Am I really, or is he? I will return you to the main river so you can continue your journey. Oh, did I go the wrong way? Okay, I went the wrong way. Whoopsies. I'm sorry. Okay, apparently we've been going the wrong way. Let's continue on the main river where we're supposed to be. <laughs> and... There we go. Okay, so apparently we were going the wrong way. I didn't even know we could do that, but... Now we know. So it's, I guess it's going to be important that we listen to all the people and find out where we're actually supposed to be going. And let's check the water. One good fish. We'll get that fish and then we'll go. And let's see, let's check in. Okay, still on course here. Mm. There we go, we have arrived. Hello, sir, that's a fancy white suit you're wearing. Hello, welcome to Fordlandia. Who are you? I am Henry Ford. You know, Ford automobiles. I invented them. I'm the most successful businessman in the United States. I, I, well, for one thing, we're not in the United States. And two, I hate to break it to you, but you're dead. And three, you're not the most successful. But anyway, what are you doing here? I'm trying to develop a rubber plantation so I can make tr tires for my cars. You see, the British have cornered the market on rubber. If I can produce my own, I won't have to pay their outlandish prices. That sounds like a good plan, but... Oh, so it's going terrible. I was told it would be easy. What could be so hard about growing a plant in its natural environment? But I've had nothing but trouble. Tell me more. My rubber trees are starting to develop a strange problem. I think it's called leaf blight. It's funny, the rubber trees in the rainforest don't seem to have it. Maybe because they're not meant to be on plantations. And do you want to trade? Of course I'll trade with you. You have harpoons. I like harpoons because I like to fish. Sure, we can trade that. What is today's date? It is January 31st, 1931. Ooh, 3131. What is the rainforest like here? I can't say anything good about it. The soil here is poor and rocky. Sometimes it rains too much. Sometimes it doesn't rain enough. I don't understand why rubber trees grow so well in the rainforest, but so poorly on my plantation. Tell me more. I've built an entire city here. The third largest in the Amazon. It's got schools, a hospital, beautiful homes. Even so, I'm having a hard time keeping good workers. I see. Goodbye. I will talk to your friend here. Hola. Who are you? My name is Emilio. I am a Siring... Siringiro. A rubber tapper. What are you doing? Duh. Normally, I travel the rainforest gathering latex from rubber trees, but now I am working for Mr. Ford. Tell me more. The pay is good, but the working conditions are very bad. Mr. Ford makes us live in strange houses and eat American food. I wish I had time to go fishing and gathering my own food in the rainforest. I see. Do you want to trade? See, si. I don't have much to offer, but I would like to trade. You have rubber, and you said you needed food. So I'm going to give you food. Is it a deal? That is a good deal. Okay, we're done trading. Do you know what today's date is? It's sometime in January or February, I think. 1931. What is the rainforest like here? The land is very hilly and rocky. It's no good for growing rubber trees. After we cleared the land, the rains came and washed the soil into the river. Oh, so that's why the rubber trees aren't growing. Mr. Ford, are you listening to your people? Because they're telling you what's wrong. It's foolish to try to grow rubber trees in a plantation. With so many trees together, insects and disease attack them. It's much better to harvest latex from the trees that grow naturally in the rainforest. 
I see. Has anybody told him that? Goodbye. So, uh, can I ask him how to go up river? We are at Farnlandia. Henry Ford's foolish dream. Wow. Here we go. How do I go up river? When you leave here, you'll see a big island. Stay to the right of that island. After that, stick to the south bank. Thank you. Goodbye. So, did we make our achievement? Let's find out. We did! The Ancient Ones are pleased that you would share your food. As a symbol of what you have done, I will complete this section of my shield. And we got what looks like, I think, rubber on a stick. So cool! We got another achievement. We met Henry Ford and his workers, and we discovered why his rubber plantation is not working out here. And uh, why Henry Ford is doing so poorly. But anyway, so that's enough for this episode. I'm trying to keep all of them short. Uh, I'll be, of course, be playing more of this. I'm going to plan to play it all the way to the end. You know, and just unless anything terrible happens to my game save file. But either way, thank you guys so much for watching, and I'll see you guys in the next video. Bye-bye!